Taoiseach. Uh, first of all, the large-scale residential development bill uh, is going to be debated, uh, finished second stage at four o'clock and then is in committee at six o'clock. Meanwhile, the maritime area uh, bill for report and final stages, which involves exactly the same spokespeople, uh, is going to be in the dole at four to seven. Now that's completely unacceptable. People cannot be in the same place, two places at the same time. It is also unacceptable that the time allocated for the maritime area planning bill dealing with offshore development uh, has been guillotined to three hours, which will not allow uh, many of the amendments thank to this incredibly deputy. important bill you, uh, to, be, uh, to be discussed. Sorry, just very lastly, Count. The, uh, the bill on Thursday to do with mandatory quarantine, uh, we still haven't seen yet, uh, and uh, we, it's going to be guillotined. And then the Friday Health and Criminal Justice thank Bill, thank giving you. sweeping powers to the Minister uh, and to the Government, uh, there's been no pre-legislative scrutiny, you. despite thank demands you, from the committee Lord, that there should be. There, no, no, just, there are two members from... Well, um, first of all, I have to say as a general point, nothing is rushed in this House. Nothing at all is rushed in this House. It takes a very long time to get things done in this House and to get legislation through this House. And I make no apologies on housing. No apologies on housing. Because we've had too much delay on housing. Nice. Right across the board. And, but that's related. And that is related. You know, like, you're having an each way... Members of the opposite are having an each way bet every day and every week on a whole range of issues. And it's so, it seems to me that it suits the opposition at times that we have paralysis in terms of getting things done. The Take the Maritime Bill. The Maritime Bill is essential. Last week, deputies were in complaining about a major wind energy company pulling out that we didn't have our planning frameworks uh, through. The planning energy, Maritime Energy Bill has, given, has been given a fair degree of consideration. It will be given more consideration, but it does need to be dealt with because you know what? They've been talking about it for years. Yeah. When, I became when I became Taoiseach, I was determined to get it published and to get it through the House so that we can create a landscape for the next 10 years that people who want to develop wind energy in this country fulfil our climate change objections, our objectives, can get on with it. So make no apologies for that either. Um, and in terms of the, the planning bill is going to go to committee, will go to committee. Um, and in terms of mandatory quarantine, you all know what that is, because it wasn't so long ago when you were all screaming for it in the previous iteration and phase of the pandemic. We couldn't bring it in fast enough. Yeah. It's the same bill almost that's coming back in. I know you're sort of claiming, oh, this is outrageous that we haven't seen it. It's the same principles apply. And likewise, in terms of the public health, I mean, which way do you want it? Yeah, everywhere. You wanted zero COVID one time. Now we're bringing in legislation that's going to be restrictive of, 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 of citizens' rights. Talk about incoherence, inconsistency. You label that at the government from time to time. Every single month it changes in here. Uh, and all I'm simply saying is the public health, expend or the public health measures have to be extended. You know, that, that's all we're doing. You're all familiar with them. You know, we all do debate them and discuss them uh, at committees and at plenary session. Uh, they're not the third secret of Fatima. Uh, and that's all that's been um, put forward. Uh, and what is happening is the consolidation of existing different pieces of legislation. Um, and, 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 and that will be published. And we will, uh, you know, the, and that, that's, that's the Health Amendment Bill, and it will be published. But that's what's in it, essentially. Uh, we do want to get, have the mandatory quarantine okay. capacity on the statute books again. There was an expiry date in the previous one uh, where, where, where it Thank expired. You, are the proposed arrangements... And, and, are and the, the home care assistance... And the home care assistance, the Minister will um, check that out. Okay. Perhaps we've done a topic, but we will follow that through, because okay. I take your point. And in terms of the Minister, when he's done difficulties, but whether it can be fitted to this particular schedule this week or not, I'd Thank see. You. But we have no difficulty. And you know he's quite no, prepared no, to come before the House and, 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 and debate that. Thank yeah. you. I'm moving on. Are the proposed arrangements... Can, no, no, can the Business Committee convene no, no. to sort these no, no. issues out? No, no. This is a, this is a political point. It's actually no, about no, a point. Deputy, deputy please. This, this, is a question on, this is a question on the order, on the order of business. business. I am now, you know, you've got a chance, everyone. No, no. Taoiseach has responded. No, he, he didn't respond to the, to the not, question I asked. I, I can't. Last, honestly, he didn't. I, honest, I, last, can I, it's, he didn't respond to the question I asked about two things being set against each other where the same people are...
Okay, there's your answer. Now we're moving no. on. Are, are the proposed arrangements for this week's business agreed to? No. no. Agreed? No. Not agreed. Okay. No. The question is that the proposed arrangements for this week's business is a, be agreed to. Na chakti atara hiv na kesta abrigi ta, na chakti ta na gwena abrigi nil, sto gwelan kesta richa, vota.